Great. Woo. Woo. Hello, Las Vegas. Hello. How you guys doing? Yeah. Awesome. That's what we're. Uh, it's fantastic to be here again. Yep. So many new friends, mm -hmm. old friends, familiar faces. How are you doing? You okay? Woo. I love the energy here, it's fantastic. I know, and it's great for me to be back in Vegas because this is now my fifth E-Vegas that I've been to. First time that I've been on this stage though, uh, but already it's just been so great walking around, catching up with so many familiar people. You come here that many times and you get a list as long as your arm of, uh, of people that you want to meet when you get back into the town and they're just grabbing you left and right, giving you hugs. It's the best, it's so good. Perfect, perfect. <laughs> so who here is the first time in Vegas this year? Show around the fans. Wow, okay. Nice. That's a, who's been to Vegas two times? Okay. Three times? Woo. Who's been to all Eve Vegas before? Yeah, okay. We got some nice veterans here. Are you okay, mate? Uh, it's this shirt, man. It's a, little bit, it's a little bit small, do you think? I mean, just maybe just take it off. I, I mean, think it I kinda, mean, you look all right, but it, if it you're does, uncomfortable. It, it does kind of flatter my man boobs, right. but it is it's kind of uncomfortable. So luckily, I got uh, right. I, I got my e okay. my proper e Vegas shirt earlier today. Yeah. So. <laughs> what? Oh. Oh. what is this, man? Every time, oh, every time. I we mean, can't get this right. Just I once. knew we should not be listening to Loki. Yeah, yeah, I know. He's, right. the, he's the worst. Also, although I did notice just for a second, a few people went eh? like checking right. their own. Did you check your guys' t-shirts as well? I was going to try you guys and say just quietly, there's a few sneaky ones that have been given out just to see how many phones came on while you're yeah. checking your shirts out, but I decided to leave that out. Anyway, uh, anyway. Yeah, it's uh, one it's of the good. gigs that we do for, for the World Tour. I think it started in Sydney when we absolutely intentionally misspelled Sydney. And yeah. from now on, we're creating one of those t-shirts. There was a uh, Tontoro. Uh, yeah. Was it, I think for Toronto, Berlin with a Y. We found yes, the Y that we lost for, in Sydney. And for FanFest Home, I cannot really pronounce this. No, well, that. Kimonosari or. Kemionsari. Kemionsari, there you go. My Finnish friends are just love that, so yeah. sad now. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, like the World Tour has been fantastic this year. It's been keeping us busy for a whole year. Mm. We've been going all over around the world. We went to Amsterdam, we went to St. Petersburg. We went to Sydney in Australia, we went to Toronto, we went to, where did we go? I have it on the list. Yeah, yeah in Finland, you've been in Berlin as well? Yes, yeah, that was an awesome uh, event G Fleet and I had to put together and it was great to support them as CCP for their own events. Yeah, I, I think it's, a, it's great to see that when we're supporting local organizers and just enabling them to do the things they do best, even better, mm -hmm. it's, it, it's just so valuable. Yeah, you know? and that was, that was the whole purpose behind the Invasion World Tour. We took the resources that we would normally put into FanFest in Iceland, and instead of having one like huge global meetup, we deployed them to all these established meetups around the world to send more devs, just to elevate the whole thing, uh, provide awesome streams for them so more people could watch them, and it's been an absolute blast. And that kind of interaction with the players is brilliant because nothing beats face-to-face -face contact. Absolutely, yeah. and I, I've been privileged enough to go almost to all of those events, and, and it has been fantastic to see all the new players and new faces coming in just because CCP was coming to visit them, and I think this is the main lesson that we got from the World Tour, mm -hmm. that coming exactly where the community is, it's, it's just so bloody cool. That's what man. you need to do. Yeah. But now, here we are in Las Vegas, and we're really excited to be spending the next couple of days with you guys talking about something that is close to all of our hearts, internet spaceships. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, give yourself a round of applause. Exactly. It's serious business. Um, and uh, those local events that we had around the year, we had, there wasn't just uh, the local communities that yeah. were coming together for it. People from adjacent countries and far away came to, to all those other cities to spend some time with other players and, and meet with us, and that was fantastic. And Vegas is no different. For in Vegas, we've got people from all over the world as well who have uh, traveled here for the event. Um, there's uh, Germany, Denmark, Great Britain, Mexico, Norway, Australia, uh, Ireland, Sweden, <laughs> heaps. But, of course, as you would expect uh, for Eve Vegas, one country dominates them all. The USA! USA. Yeah. There it is. Yeah. Yeah, there I, told you, I told you. I, I, knew it's I gonna told happen. you they are going to do it. Yep. Oh, yep. You guys Every never year. disappoint. Yep. Never. Yeah. All right. And thank, thank you for welcoming us. It's been awesome so far. And I'm looking forward to uh, what we've got ahead. Yeah, I mean, it only shows how 
global community. If online is, you know, we got players from all over the world. You never know when you're gonna go on a fleet or you join a corp if you're gonna meet players from Netherlands or Australia, and you know, it's just just crazy, man. Yeah, it's, and I've it's made absolutely I've crazy. made lifelong friends all over the world from the 15 years that I've been playing EU. Yeah, yeah, and it's, it means it's, it's awesome. Yeah, and then uh, obviously we have like uh, players flying under different banners. We got different alliances mm -hmm, here as mm -hmm, well. Mm -hmm. um, actually, some some literal banners or flags yeah, over here yeah. as well. Do you guys horde see some guys. flags? Can you show them around? What do we have here? You got the horde Which guys. Is a couple there, okay. Yeah. Well, we really need to have some more flags next time around. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Oh, oh yeah, there we go. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Beautiful. Oh. It's really bright up here. Actually, um, do you guys want to see the top 10 uh, alliances in terms of attendance for EVE Online, for yeah. Vegas? Yeah. OK. All right, let's, uh, All let's right. take a look what we have. If, when your name comes up, shout out. We want to know where you're sitting. Start. The initiative. initiative. Yeah. We'll see who is the loudest. All right, right. OK. Brave, Brave Collective. Snuffed out. Yeah. yeah, we understand. Understand. Very sad news in terms yeah. of snuffed out disbanding, but yeah. I think there is still a lot of pilots who yeah. are snuffs in their hearts. Yeah. And, uh, and to show it. The, the good news is uh, the rest of the alliances here now have a fantastic uh, recruitment opportunity. <laughs> Because there are, there, are, there are a bunch of pilots here who are awesome at dropping hells on Ibises in low sec. <laughs> so, you know, if, if you need to fill that gap in your corp roster, you know who to turn to. Blue Sun Interstellar Technologies. Oh, all right. They're winning right now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, they are sitting right at the front. Yeah. So. <laughs> the Bastion. Bastion. Northern NC Coalition. Ooh, that was no, right. strong. I felt that. Mental note. Yeah, yeah. Pandemic, Pandemic Legion. Legion. Are you guys tired? It's like you're partying too much. <laughs> well, that explains it. Pandemic Horde. Horde. Oh, okay. That's better, much better. Test the Alliance, line. please ignore. Wait, can you guys confirm that you're actually the best Alliance? Yeah. <laughs> right, um, who's last? Oh. Goose World Federation. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> They're still winning in numbers. Yep. You're just encouraging them. <laughs> and it's, uh, keep going, give him some more heat. Yeah. No, it's all right. But um, it's not just you guys who have turned out in force. Uh, CCP has also brought a massive army to Vegas this year. In fact, this is the biggest contingent of developers that has ever come to eVegas. Yeah. So there's uh, over 40 of us here. Uh, there's game designers, there's programmers, there's game masters, there's art people. Um, uh, we might not all look quite this attractive in, in real life. The, uh, the, the character creator is uh, quite flattering. Um, but if you see anyone walking around in a dev shirt, we're here for you guys and we want to speak to you guys. So just like grab them and say, hey, what's up? Um, and just pitch, pitch your idea. Oh, you know, what makes you happy? What makes you sad? We want to hear it all. I think it's you know the primary reason why we are here. We're, we just want to talk to you guys. We want to hear your feedback. We want to hear your concerns. We want to talk spaceship and just see you know what 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 motivates you, what what clicks you, what you think about the game. Uh, so don't be shy. We want to talk. We're gonna be hanging around uh, the weekend. We're gonna be joining the pub crawl. We're gonna be going all to different different events. So just find us, have a chat. I've actually been here. And for a like beer couple of days already, so I've been talking to many of you, but there's still a bunch of people that I really want to talk to, so please find me on the corridor, let's have a conversation, um, and I want to hear everything you have to say. Hug, hug a lot, it's important. <laughs> um, so, the Flamingo, man, what a cool casino. It's, it's huge, man. It is massive. It's huge. 
So we're going to go over just sort of the lay of the land a little bit for the next couple of days so that you guys can find your way around and know where to be and what things you can be doing. Uh, right now, we're in, uh, we're in uh, Vista, which is the main presentation room. So there'll be presentations happening here all weekend. Just outside here in these other two rooms, the B and C on the map, uh, starting from this side, we've got our, uh, our studio, which is where our stream will be going in between presentations. So there'll be interviews with guests and developers and players uh, on the couch out there. So feel free to hang around the background. And if you've got a cool flag or something like that, just sort of like mm, get it in the shot and tell people, tell, hey, hey, mom, I'm going to be on Twitch. And she'll be like, What's, what the hell's Twitch? But you know. We're, we're super happy to have uh, Bjorn B and CCP Antiquarian mm -hmm. acting as a host. I think they're going to be doing a fantastic job. Mm -hmm. They're going to be bringing a lot of content in between. So if you're watching from home, you definitely want to be paying attention to those guys. Yep. There's also the Art Corner, which is running today and tomorrow. And that'll be uh, CCP Mirker and CCP Blue Screen. And they'll be showing you some concept art, some cool 3D modeling that they've been doing, uh, some cool new VFX. And you can just look over their shoulder as they're playing around with their tools so that you can see how they make all the amazing artwork that makes its way into New Eden for you guys to oogle. Um, uh, let me see, what else we've got out there? We've got the store. Oh, yeah. Yeah? The if you store. guys want to get some Eve swag, because that's the thing we all like to do, right? I mean, I did my shopping already. Mm -hmm. I what about you guys? Did you guys buy anything? You picked anything up? Yeah. I really want to get one of those interbus luggage tags, because it turns out buying just like a nondescript black suitcase is the worst idea in the world for when you're trying to get your baggage off the carousel. So yeah, something that'll make it stand out would be a nice little touch. Um, we've also out there got uh, the, uh, the, the tournament, PVP tournaments are happening out here. That'll be rolling uh, over the weekend as well. And, and uh, CCP Dopamine will tell you a little bit more about that in a minute. But you can, uh, and it's, the hangout room is there too. So you've got like lots of tables, lots of chairs for you to sit down and relax on. And you can watch the tournament and just grab people as they're uh, going by and uh, talk to them about spaceships. Yeah, we also have uh, like four demo stations where uh, we actually have the ships and fittings that we're going to be using in the tournament. So if you didn't have a chance to sign up and you want to fly with the wacky fits that we actually prepared this time around, <laughs> you're more than welcome to. Uh, we also have some ships to uh, accommodate those people who would prefer to run some abyssal sites. So if there's some downtime, you want to sit down, maybe chill with your mates, that's definitely a nice place to hang out. Yeah, man. Um, then next, uh, a little bit further down the corridor, we have the Reno One. Uh, this is the room. We're actually going to have the Eve Echoes demo. Uh, so if that's something you're interested, you wanted to check out the new mobile game that we've been working on together with NetEase, mm -hmm. Uh, you can definitely sign up if you're going to speak with uh, CCP Rex or C CCP Alpha. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure they're going to be able to sort you out. Uh, I've been playing actually quite a bit of if Echoes myself during the technical alpha and, uh, and internal testing. And I am absolute, absolutely mind blown. How did they manage to squeeze in all the beautifulness that you have in EVE yeah. Online on a mobile device. Some, like some of you guys might not be mobile gamers and maybe on the fence about Echoes, but it's going to be just around the corner. You guys really have to try it out. While you're lining up for registration today, you may have noticed the, the screen outside the Echoes room that was just showing in-game footage from the game. And my first experience looking at it was I, was I walked past it a half a dozen times before I stopped and went like, oh, wait, that's not actually the PC client of EVE running. That's the mobile version of the game. It looks stunning. Give it a shot. It's pretty cool. Uh, then the room next door is going to be our roundtable room. So we got uh, a couple of those uh, lined up later during the week. Uh, so take a look at the schedule later on. If there's something that interests you, this is definitely the location you want to be. And then lastly, further down the corridor, uh, we have the Laughlin tool. This is going to be our secondary presentation room. So all the different presentations we weren't able to squeeze in on the main stage, uh, they're going to be happening there. We have actually quite a few very interesting player presentations. Mm -hmm. I think you also going to be presenting something there later, right? Yes, I would be doing a mildly interesting presentation on Sunday. So if you guys want to come and find out about some of the weird things that I found laying around on CCP's file servers after I started working there, you know, come and I'm, I'm going I'm to try not to stray into somewhat interesting territory. Just keep it mild, all right? So, but you can, you, can come and, uh, you can come and find me in there on Sunday if you want to check that out. Yeah, all right. So. You know, where we know where we are. Let's take a look what's going to be happening here because there's plenty of content. Today, we, we pretty, we're pretty light. We wanted to give you guys some time to chillax, catch up with your friends. Mm -hmm. uh, so after this, we're just going to have a keynote. Obviously, 
this is a presentation you don't want to miss. CCP Burger, CCP Rice, CCP Larrikin, they've been hard at work together with an army of helpers putting together all the information that we're really looking forward to share with you today. Um, so yeah, definitely you need to make it because it's gonna be great, all right? Then we're gonna have a few hours uh, of break and then at seven, uh, we are going to be going to one of the most famous streets in Las Vegas, yeah. the Fairmont Street. At seven o'clock, uh, we're gonna be meeting in a um, valet somewhere location or in the lobby, mm -hmm. definitely. Valley is, there we go. Thank you very much, Gregel. <laughs> Perfect. You should be doing this. Can you, do you wanna, <laughs> yeah, yeah, do you wanna finish it? <laughs> Uh, we're going to be meeting there at 7 p.m. We're going to be getting into the groups. Uh, and at 7.30, we're going to have buses going uh, to the Fairmont Street. And then later on, after the pub crawl finishes, uh, we're also going to have buses back to Flamingo. So you have, don't have to be worried about the transport. Mm -hmm. uh, the registration for the pub crawl already started at 2 p.m. at the registration desk. So if you bought the tickets and you haven't selected the group, uh, you definitely want to swing by there very quickly after the opening ceremony and just pick the group uh, that you like the most. I know it's going to be mine, mine. so... Mine. Oh, please, no, no. I'm sorry. That's fine, that's fine. <laughs> just be mindful. we got a plenty of devs. Again, there's going to be enough of us. Um, and it's going to be a lot of fun. I think it's going to be amazing. Yeah, man. Yeah? All right. And tomorrow is a big, thick, and juicy day of presentations for you. That's when they're all going to be coming at you. Um, so uh, uh, there's more content happening at eVegas this year than we've seen in previous years. Our player presenters are really stepping up as well and helping to sort of fill out the schedule. We'll be running two rooms simultaneously, uh, so it's going to be, in some cases, difficult for you guys to choose which uh, stuff you want to go and see, but uh, obviously if, if you're missing an event that's on Vista because you'd rather be in the, uh, in the secondary room, uh, the VODs will be on Twitch, so you can watch, you can watch them when you get home or uh, when, you get back, when you get back to your hotel room. Uh, and the ones in the other room will be recorded as well and released at some point in the not-too-distant future for you guys to enjoy. Um, uh, but the, uh, that's not all, because after today's, uh, yesterday, tomorrow's, Jesus. Wow, okay, all right. <laughs> I think time zones are really killing you, man. Yeah, man. All right. <laughs> After tomorrow's amazing schedule of presentations, we're taking it to Omnia at Caesars Palace for the Ooh, eve, oh, yeah, oh, for yeah. the Vegas party. Thank you, that person. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, we'll be hosting the event in both the heart of Omnia and also out on their roof terrace space, which is absolutely beautiful. So you guys need to make sure you come along for that. Um, if you bought a ticket to Vegas, you got a ticket to it. So why wouldn't you be there? Um, the party will kick off at 7.30. And, uh, but of course, it wouldn't be a real E Vegas party if we didn't have Permaban. Permaban yeah. will be oh. playing at E Vegas this year. Oh, I love those guys so much. They've uh, they've been uh, they've got a. a is it, are you practicing yeah, your yeah, dancing I'm, tomorrow I'm just night? Some moves, man. Oh, I mean, that's, cool. that's sweet. Just Get mention the word Permaban and sets him off. Um, they've been uh, they've been working on a whole bunch of songs. They're, it's like they're still spitting hot fire. It's great. Uh, they'll be playing some classics that you love, but also some new covers as well. So it'll be, a, yep. it'll be an exciting new set for you guys to enjoy. Yeah, they've been having a lot of rehearsals, and uh, they're definitely trying to you know, spice things up and, mm -hmm. and keep them fresh for you. So it will be a very unique performance, and it's happy to share it with you guys. Yeah. Yep. But keep in mind, it is a Vegas nightclub, and it's a fancy, it's a fancy joint. So yep. you guys need to look your best. There is a dress code. Uh, that the venue will be enforcing. So um, it's here on the screen for you guys right now, but it also uh, is printed in the eVegas mega blog that was released about a, a week ago, which you can just find on the eVonline Online website if you want to just sort of go through it just to make sure that you're all set. So we, because we don't want you guys to miss out on that party. And then on Sunday, after we wake up fresh and have a sip of a Gatorade to wake us up, uh, we have another day full of content. Um, the thing I'm most excited about is obviously the Invasion Tournament Series. Mm -hmm. uh, it's going to be the sixth Invasion Tournament Series we had this year. Um, we got 15 teams on site that will be participating in the tournament. By the look of it, we have some regulars that have been traveling around the world as well to try and get their secure day spot uh, for the global finals that will be played at FanFest 2020 in April. Um, I'm actually looking forward as well just to see 
what they're gonna do with those wacky feeds that we prepared for mm -hmm. them because we don't go easy on them. We don't give them the best fits. We want to see how creative they are and what we, they can do with the poor ships that we're preparing for them. Nice. Right. And for those of you guys who are watching at home, the whole event is going to be streamed by a hardworking and dedicated stream fleet team. They, uh, yeah, you, there yeah, we go. They, give them a round of applause. Of do course. It. Why not? Most deserved. Yeah. So you'll be able to check all that out on Twitch. Um, uh, and also, for you guys in the room and at home, there's a digital version of the schedule so that you can quick reference to see what's going to be on. You can get there. It's on, this, on the screen right now at the bottom. It's evegas2019.sked.org. And uh, even if you're uh, actually going to be here for the event, you should probably get that app so that you can plan out your uh, weekend and not miss a thing. Yeah, absolutely. I, I think it's very difficult to remember everything, at least. Uh, I had trouble I, remembering I, what yeah. day it was. Yeah, exactly. So yeah. it's a great example. While well, keeping things handy, it's important. Mm -hmm. uh, but we also want to hear what you guys are talking about. Either how are you enjoying in Vegas or how are you enjoying it from home. So please let us know. We want to hear from you. Include the Eve Vegas hashtag whenever you're talking on Twitter or reaching out to us uh, on Discord or all the different platforms that we are. Uh, we're also going to be running some cool. Um, online giveaways over the weekend, so that's something that Bjorn B and CCP Antiquarian is going to be telling you a little bit more later about. We got some cool swag prepared, so it's, it's definitely worth it to keep attention to it. Sweet. And of course, uh, we want to give a shout out to our sponsors who give us an enormous amount of assist assistance. That's Corsair and AMD. Yeah. So give them a Thank you. Give them a hand. It's great to collaborate with these guys, and it's with their support that we can put on uh, an event to a, a certain level that you guys expect. If you look out there in the PvP tournament room, it's like heaps of Corsair gear, lots of RGB goodness, and all those kinds of things. So um, yes, thank you to those guys. It uh, at least increases your APM by 50. Yeah, no that's stress. right. People say RGB does nothing. It's not true. Yeah, but I, I think we, we've covered pretty much everything, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. it's. Uh, it's fantastic, again, to be here with you guys one more time. Please be excellent to each other. Look after your fellow corp mates. We want to have a good time. We want to be in a safe environment. And it's really up to us to, to make it a great weekend. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, and yeah. let the festivities begin. We're going to have a short break after the opening ceremony. But again, afterwards, we're going to have the most important Eve keynote. You don't want to miss it. If you want to grab a drink, have a break, Take a breather. You can do it now, but we're going to be back shortly. Okay? Cool. Vegas, we love you. Thank you, guys. Woo!